What's going on guys, it's your boy Brad, back with another video. Before I get into this video, as always, hit that subscribe button down below. I'm putting out videos every week, trying to help you guys obtain your dream of becoming a registered nurse. Enjoy this update. So yes, guys, this is an update on um, where I'm at in school right now, a vlog for you guys. Um, so I am finished officially with my first year of nursing school. I can't believe it, it's crazy. This past year has flown by, man. I just finished med search two. Um, that was the last little piece of this semester. If you guys have been following uh, with me, I've had two regular lecture exams. I'll just give you the grade update. Two regular lecture exams in this med search two, and then a final. On my first update that I gave you guys, on my first exam I had made an 88. Since then, I took the second regular exam and I made an 88 as well. So between those two grades, I was teetering very hard. Um, very close to an A, but I was still below it. An A in my program is a 90. We're on a 10 point scale. Had the final exam, and on the final exam, I made a 91. So that grade, which is an A, so that grade, plus all of my other grades, um, quiz grades and miscellaneous grades, it was enough to give me the A in MedSearch 2. So I finished the semester with a 4.0 GPA. I made an A in Peds and OB, and then I just made an A in MedSearch 2. So it feels good, man. It feels good to have that under my belt, complete that, get the 4.0 GPA, get back to making the A's that I'm used to making. Of course, you know, it's different in nursing school. It's a lot more difficult. But yeah, it feels good to get that, get that out of the way, get that knowledge under my belt, you know, that med search 2 knowledge. The uh, I think all in all, we covered a lot of cardiovascular things, you know, a lot of uh, heart disease, heart failure, myocardial infarctions, angina. Then there was a lot of inflammation kinds of things. Um, cholecystitis, cholelithiasis, renal calculi, <clears throat> uh, nephrolithiasis, I think that's how, yeah, nephrolithiasis, um, BPH, colon cancer, prostate cancer, a lot of stuff like that. So that's basically what all we covered in MedSearch 2. So like I said, it's good to get all that knowledge and that information under my belt, in my brain, um, and retain it to take it forward with me in my future education but yeah man it's really bonkers it's just real crazy to me to you know because just the other day I went back and I was looking at my very first week um my first week of nursing school ever I just went back to look at that video and it's so funny seeing how far I've come from there uh to where I am now and like I said it's, it feels like it was just yesterday that I was beginning nursing school that I was attending orientation um attending my first clinical and to see how far I've come and how much knowledge I've gained in this short year, um, it's really crazy. And it's exciting because I know that this next year is going to probably fly by even quicker because, you know, we're going to be moving up into more advanced education. Uh, I believe this upcoming semester we're going to have MedSearch 3 and we're also going to have Psych. And I know that there are going to be other components and I cannot remember what they are off the top of my head. I'm just fried, man. This is finals week and I'm done. So I've been studying like crazy, but yeah, so, you know, I'm going to have all that to look forward to, and I'm just going to be going into my senior semester really. And I'll be graduating in December of next year. So, you know, I'll be job hunting, um, preparing, prepping for the NCLEX and everything. So it's all really flying by. It, it really is for you guys out there who are about to be beginning nursing school, or for those of, the, of you who want to go into nursing school and you think it's just going to take forever, man, it flies by. It really does. I really highly recommend just soaking up everything that you can, man. Not only knowledge, not only studies, but your experiences, because it really is gone in the blink of an eye. So really make the most of it and get the most out of it that you can. An additional update that I wanted to give you guys is that I have a job. I will be beginning at the first of the year, we'll be beginning a uh, CNA or nurse tech, where whatever it's called, where you are. So yeah, I'll be on a medical surgical floor coincidentally the floor that I just did my clinical rotations on and also coincidentally the first floor that my wife ever worked at when she was a new grad out of uh, college so yeah that's pretty interesting I'm looking forward to that I'm looking forward to getting hands-on care with these patients outside of the little bit of time that we have in clinicals and just immersing myself in the the hospital world you know the ins and outs the daily routine of hospital life and um 
caring for these patients, these surgical patients. But yeah, I think it's gonna be really great. It's gonna be a really awesome experience and I'm really looking forward to it. I got a lot of things, this is something else I should mention, uh, just since I'm giving you life updates. I've got a lot of things to look forward to for this YouTube channel here in the near future. I've got a lot of collaborations that I'm trying to secure. I'm in the process of securing that I think are gonna be really great for you guys. I think it's gonna be really great content cool collaborations too you know cool people i'm trying to network as best i can because uh, i said this before in my video where i said you should create a youtube channel a nursing youtube channel i'm really wanting to promote unification of this online youtube nursing community i really want i want to connect and unify this nursing community i want you guys you subscribers to be exposed to more people, more uh, great channels that are providing great content. And I think collaborations is a great way to do that. And uh, I'm just really excited for what the future holds, guys. I'm really, you know, I have really big aspirations, um, not, not just in um, my actual direct nursing career, which I do. The sky's the limit in my mind. It really is. I've got very high dreams there as well, but also in the social media aspect. Um, I really, in the future, in the near future, I would really like to maybe attend some conferences, some expos, do some public speaking. I'd like to go to different uh, universities and colleges and speak to incoming nursing classes, speak to graduating nursing classes. I think that would be something that's a really a good niche of mine. I like to try and be a motivational speaker. I like to try and be an inspiration for people. And I really want to try and you know, guide people and ease their transition into nursing programs and into nursehood when that time comes. So, um, and that's the whole purpose of this channel, you know, to try and provide you guys with great content, <clears throat> steer you in the right direction, tell you what pitfalls to avoid, and just try and provide you with great materials and resources to help you be successful. And that is what I really want to do. Those are my big aspirations to take it from a uh, from a multimedia platform to a physical platform, traveling to various places and, um, you know, doing public speaking and things of that nature. Anyways, I'm done rambling. I hope you guys enjoyed this little update. Uh, you can look forward to more, but for now I'm going to enjoy my Christmas break. I hope you guys do the same. If you still have final exams to take, good luck to you. Okay. Study hard, knock it out. And don't forget over this Christmas break, do not let your brain rot. Okay. Take a little time here and there and get in the books a little bit and stay fresh and stay on your toes because we've got another semester to tackle in a month or so. And for those of you who are graduating, congratulations, man. I wish you the best. I really do. Anyways, Nurse Bass, soon to be. I'll catch you on the next video. Subscribe. Catch you in the next one. Peace.